Kentucky heads to Vanderbilt. And Vanderbilt, a 13.5 point home dog on this one. I, oh, the total is at 50, and it's 11 a.m. Central Time on the SEC Network. Let's uh, let's go on and pull up the numbers here so you can see them. Again, I'll pause this at some point uh, and pull up the full sheet so that you can pause it uh, and, and get a look at the, the full numbers and whatnot. Uh, Kentucky's strength of schedule is dead last per ESPN up here, and you, you can see it up there. But I, I still don't know that that necessarily matters because it's not like Vanderbilt has played a tough strength of schedule and they just lost to UNLV. Something that my numbers don't have in here is the fact that Vanderbilt uh, quarterback A.J. Swan was uh, kind of banged up last week against UNLV. We'll see what that means for this week. Uh, but you look at just basic overall stuff, right? Net points per drive, Kentucky's number 16, Vanderbilt number 72. You look at PPA margin, that's predicted points added. Uh, Kentucky's number 27, and Vanderbilt is number 114. Uh, I don't see a reason why Kentucky should not be able to cover 13 and a half. I don't know why this line has not moved, right? That's a little bit concerning to me that maybe people just don't trust Kentucky. Maybe. I mean, it doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me, but obviously we will, we will figure that out uh, at some point, but good gracious uh, field position is a, a major factor for Kentucky here over Vanderbilt. Major edge. Uh, scoring opportunities per game, that's a major edge for Kentucky as well. Uh, their offense, really good passing the ball thus far. Number 29 PPA per pass. Number 21 in passing success rate. Well, Vandy can't stop the pass or the run, really. Uh, this is this is odd that we have got to this point. Now, Kentucky does play incredibly slow, so maybe that's got something to do with this, but I think Kentucky should be a substantial favorite here. I mean, you see at the top, I've got them power rated by 20. Um, I've got Kentucky by 24.46, so 24.5 on this. So I'm 10 points off the spread. That's not common for me. But, alas, uh, we'll see. that This has been a strange year, Um I mean, transfer portal, all that kind of stuff probably plays into it. But, yeah, give me Kentucky uh, to cover the 13-and-a-half on the road. Uh, Vandy, they got some kinks to work out for sure. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and follow me on Twitter, at GaryWCE. If you want to toss in a question, you can email me, Gary, at winningcureseverything.com. Make sure and hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you next time.